I'm Lieutenant General Xavier Brunson, Commander of America's First Corps here at Joint Base Lewis-McChord in Washington State. I'd like to say thank you to our civilian aides to the Secretary of the Army for volunteering to serve the Army and the nation. Our CASAs are America's link to the community. We are proudly celebrating a hundred year legacy of your service. Our CASA program dates back to 1922, but much remains unchanged. Today, our civilian aides continue to assist with coordination between the public and the Army, providing a bridge between the Army and our communities. Today, these key business leaders and community influencers continue to provide a vital link between the Army and their local areas. CASAs assist our recruiters by telling the Army's story, supporting the total Army workforce by serving as our liaison to their communities, and helping our transitioning soldiers and their families. And they do all this as volunteers and have done so for a hundred years. Our CASAs are force multipliers when it comes to supporting the U.S. Army Recruiting Command in its war for talent. As a continuity in their states and community, CASAs assist recruiters and help the Army meet mission, using their long-term community connections to get authentic access into schools for our recruiters. Here at Joint Base Lewis-McChord, we have the privilege to work regularly with three CASAs from Spokane, Seattle, and Portland. They have helped us connect with our communities all around Washington and Oregon, and they bring leaders from the communities and Army together to work toward the art of the possible. No other service has a civilian aids program, and I think it's just one more reason that the United States Army is the best place to be and best place to lead. Happy 100th anniversary, CASA program, and thank you to all our CASAs.